Welcome back to the channel, everybody. In this video, I wanna quickly show you how to configure the tooltip on an XY chart. So I'll go ahead and create a view and I'm gonna resize this a little bit. Now I'm gonna grab my XY chart, drop it on there. I'll just make it grow to size. And by default, when you first drop this component onto your view canvas, it's gonna have some example data and it'll have some axes configured as well as two series that are both rendered as lines. And by default, this tooltip inside of the series will be enabled. But if I hit play, you'll see that that tooltip never shows up. To fix this, you gotta drill into line, appearance, bullets, open this instance here and hit enabled. Now you'll have these dots on your line and when you hover over them, you'll see the tooltip. Okay. If I wanted to, instead of rendering this as a line, have it be a column, because this tooltip is enabled by default, you'll see this is uh, showing the tooltip and I didn't have to drill into this column object to configure it. So when your series is configured as a column, this uh, top level tooltip object is where you'll configure the tooltip. But when you're using a line, you'll need to come into this bullets object and enable it. And then you can configure the tooltip from there. Now you can configure a tooltip to have multiple series as data. And the way that I've done this is I'm just going to configure the name manually. So process temp, and then I'm going to change value Y to the name of the column. And then I'm going to do the same for my other value. Okay, hit that. And let's see how oh, that was on my line. Now you can see my tooltip includes both series is data and I can copy that and apply that. Make sure that it has the new line in there. Apply that to my column and now I should have my tooltip configured for both of my series. Simple as that. I hope that this has helped. Uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and we'll see you next time.